this is Kishida's first visit to the United States since taking office as prime minister in October 2021. Um, it's also very interesting because uh, the Washington visit comes at the tail end of a whirlwind tour of G7 countries. Japan and the United States are seeing eye to eye when it comes to assessing the military threat that China poses. And so Japan has um, enhanced not only its defense capabilities by introducing long, long range missiles, uh, but it's also um, increasing its defense spending. What does that mean for the United States? It means that it will fundamentally change or has the potential to fundamentally change the relationship between Japan and the United States when it comes to the military alliance. To date, Japan has been very much dependent on the US security umbrella. And that will not change per se, but the amount that Japan will depend um, on the United States will decrease. The two countries will discuss security issues, but they will also discuss economic concerns and competition with China on the technology front. Japan, the United States, as well as Europe has been really impacted, not only by the disruptions caused by COVID, but also because of the economic coercion and weaponization of China's dominance in certain areas of the global economy. On the economic front, any public statement that would encourage or reassure greater coordination on the part of Japan and the United States for economic cooperation on, on technology, on critical technologies, that would also be seen as a win as well.